bro. Hey. Hey. Hey, bro. Hey, bro. You talk. You talking to me? Got um. You got any graphics cards, man? Hmm. You uh. You got any uh. You know uh. Thirty eighties, bro. Heck yeah, I got what you need, bro. I got you, dude. What uh? How much uh? How much money you talking about there, bro? Um, I got. Let me see. Um, how much I got here? Uh, ten, twenty, thirty, uh, thirty-one, thirty-two, um. 40, 41, 42, uh, 50, 51, 52, um, I got 60, 61, 62, so yeah, I got what you need, bro, I got the money, <laughs> yeah, bro, I got what you need, man, right here, I got that, I got that RTX 3080, cuz, I got you, bro, here you go, bro, here you go, hand me the money, Hand me the money and I'll give you the RTX. Hand me the money and I'll give you the RTX. Come on. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, wait a minute. Hold up, bro. There's only twelve dollars here. <laughs> I got your graphics card. I got your graphics card. Uh, 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 uh. Wait a minute. Hold up. It's a piece of cardboard, bro. <laughs> Sure, I'm gonna get. I'm not sure I'm gonna get much work done today, and I kind of got it set up, kind of the way I want it. Like I got the light put in, and then, like I said earlier, we were gonna put that power strip in. So I got the power strip. It's kind of chilling. Below, we got our shelves down here. Um, I'm gonna put this here. So that way, if I need to run power to something, I can, I'll have access to it. And then this little space right here, I'm planning on pulling those two out and putting them there. You know, I'm fixing to go out to the garage and get the water cooling, the rest of it. And I'm starting to realize something. I have a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of water cooling stuff, so much to where I may need its own like whole shelf. Uh, now, some of this stuff I could probably, I don't know, maybe sell off or whatever. But I mean, they're all in here. I I don't like. See, look, there's there's a pump. There's the other pump. And there's the other pump. So they're all full. And then I'm about to go get the eight or nine boxes of radiators see like this this is a radiator it's this before this is a three fan rgb pci express this is actually kind of cool uh maybe i'll do a video about it i haven't ran it in a build and i don't know how long but check this out this is cool see it it's pretty cool right inside here like where those rings are that's that all lights up the whole thing lights up and then you have some controls on the back. The, wait a minute, here we go. The speed, the mode, the lock, the color. Um, and then it, it runs to a, uh, well, where's the port at? It runs to a standard SATA, as you can see right there. It plugs in and it sits down inside right next to your graphics card. Or let's say you are running a computer that doesn't have a graphics card because you have integrated graphics, but then you have this big hole in your case where a graphics card is supposed to go and you can put this there in replace of it it lights up and shines it's really a nice thing and it's a lot cheaper this thing was only like 30 bucks um but yeah it's kind of cool because i'm i'm going through things and i'm like wow i forgot i even had that um like this one right here this is our msi rgb see that it's pretty cool it has the uh the aura symbol on it it's the same thing that's 
right there for our MSI Dragon logo. It's the same thing. Pretty cool, right? Yeah, those things were not too terribly expensive. And then on top of that, I didn't know that I had a wireless USB dongle. It's brand new. I was like, wow, where, where did this thing come from? And then I have some other crazy stuff. Like, look at this. This is dual M.2 to SATA 3 port. That's interesting. So you run two M.2s and then it runs to a SATA. That's interesting. No wonder why I bought that. This thing is an HDD booster. So I guess it um, it's probably a hot swappable, meaning that you put, yeah, it is. So, wow, that's brand new too. I've never even opened this thing before. So what you do is you run your, your SSD or your hard drive, plug it into there, and then it terminates out to SATA. So if you have like a mechanical hard drive, um, you can run it off of SATA, which I don't know why you want to do that now. Something like this is outdated. People nowadays uh, just run M.2, which is so much faster. Honestly, um, SATA, SATA drives, they're, they're becoming extinct, outdated. But anyway, I just wanted to show you guys that. Oh, 120 millimeter radiator. Here is another 120 millimeter radiator. And here is a, another one. So that makes three of those. And then this is um, a brand new reservoir and pump combo that I haven't got around to using at all. I've shown you all that before. Here is a 240 millimeter radiator. Set that over there. Here is another 240 millimeter radiator. Oh, what a surprise. Another 240 millimeter radiator. This is brand new. I haven't used this one yet. Okay, and then now we get into the 360s. So we have a 360, which is drying right now. And then here's our other 360. All right, we'll set that over there. And then here is, well, can I grab it? Wow, can't grab it. Wait a minute, here we go. Wait a minute, there we go. Yeah, open, ah, and there do we go. Another radiator. So. Let's see here, that's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and then there's one in the back, 11, 12. So I have 12 radiators. Oh, that reminds me, let's grab the third one and stuff. Um, but that will go in its box there, and then we'll, we'll find a place to put all of this. Let's see here, what did I do with the riser cable stuff? Oh yes, that goes over here. And um, I don't know where to put this. I guess I'll just set it there for the time being. Um, I wanted plenty of room underneath here. So that way I can put stuff underneath there and also get underneath there with the vacuum. Uh, let's see here. We pretty much put all of our CPU coolers or the ones that I like that count. They're all here. They're all full of it. All of the parts are in there. It's all there. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight of them. Eight, that's not bad. Um, SSDs and stuff, I already showed you guys that. I just haven't decided yet if I want to put this down there or leave it where it is. Um, up top, uh, you know, we kind of went over this briefly. I got more CPU, uh, out in the garage. I need to get, um, uh, boxes that need to go here with the CPUs that I need to put in there. In the back, just some extra stuff. Um, I need, oh my God, I have so many fan boxes. It was ridiculous. I had so many that the pile went like this high in the back and I was just like, nope, forget it. I'll leave them in the garage and we'll just keep some of the kits up front here. Uh, once again, somebody asked me if these were had stuff in them. Well, yeah, of course they do. Look, I'll show you. See, there it is. It's in there. Um, same with all four of them. They don't like weigh next to nothing, so the boxes will wiggle. You know, see like that, that's full, but look how easily it's wiggling. But anyway, GPU water blocks, we talked about them. All three of these, these are our brand new T-Virus reservoirs that I showed you guys. We have three of those. Um, two of them are gonna come up and up and coming build. Our Thermal Take Pacific W Plus. We ended up with two of those. So we got those both sitting up there. 
and then our bits power reservoir and stuff so anyway that's basically the gist of it i just got a little bit more cleaning to do a little bit more organization and so on chill it oh it's so pretty look how pretty you are you're so beautiful i just want you to know you're so beautiful but anyway i'm in and out of here i just wanted to say that i love you guys i appreciate y'all make sure to leave a like subscribe if you're new to this channel welcome and as always thank you guys i'm out of here bye bye peace i'm don with tech pcs and we approve this message no i'm just playing ah i love computer stuff what do y'all think? You think we got enough computer stuff? We need more. I need three more shelves filled with all this stuff. I want it to be all graphics cards and all motherboards, all power supplies. I want a shelf that contains one component. So it will be all graphics cards and then it'll be all CPUs and all this and all that. Just parts after parts after parts. I can't wait. I'll buy the shelving to do it too. So, all right, I'm done talking. Y'all be cool. See you.